And then I'm going to jump into another part here, um, and I'll just say that the next section is going to be some of the movies that I would say are my favorite uh, TV Christmas holiday shows, winter shows. And uh, the first one I'll talk about is um, one that's probably on most people's list, and uh, you know, not necessarily for Halloween, but just for anything, and that's The Simpsons. Um, I always like The Simpsons, but The Simpsons don't really have a whole lot of Christmas episodes. There's a Christmas special at the very, very beginning of the, uh, you know, the series. And then I think the next one that was like truly felt like a Christmas episode was about this time, the seventh season. And there was one where uh, Bart really wanted this video game. I don't know. It was just very funny. But, um, yeah, The Simpsons is a good one. And I think, you know, like this, the seventh season has that one I was talking about where he wants that game and he ends up not getting it, you know, and he spends the whole time trying to make up for what he did, you know. He was caught shoplifting. Uh, this is a funny one where uh, if you're into South Park, uh, definitely I would say, like most people, your favorite Christmas episode might be the very first one, which was uh, uh, Mr. Hanky, the Christmas Boo. So if you've not seen that one, that one's very funny, and it's just kind of a classic Christmas uh, episode. Uh, the Christmas episodes as they went along were a little bit more over the top, but I always thought this one was really kind of fun. It's a, I, I think most of them were pretty good. Uh, here's another one that's uh, really pretty good, and it's Futurama. Futurama has uh, a Christmas special here and there. I don't know. I, I can't remember many more than this one. Uh, this might be one of the only ones that were done. Um, but uh, on this uh, particular season, which this is season two, uh, they did one where Santa Claus was like this evil robot because in the future they kind of lost contact with what Christmas was and, and and in the future, you know, Santa Claus is this like murderous robot that goes around killing people, you know, and supposedly instead of like bad children getting a lump of coal or whatever, <laughs> they just get killed. But it's really kind of funny just to see, you know, what they think of Christmas and stuff and to see Fry try to explain it to everybody like what Christmas was like from where, you know, he came from 1999. Um... This is another classic series that does a, a good Christmas episode. Um, season two is the first season of The Office that has a Christmas special uh, because the first season was a mid-season replacement came in after Christmas. So season two starts with a, you know, a full season. But in this one, uh, it kind of starts all the craziness of the party planning committee and all the stuff and every time they want to have a Christmas party all the drama goes into making the party what everybody wants and Michael you know always kind of screws things up or whatever but it's very funny and this is the the one where they they decide they're going to do what they call a Yankee swap or whatever and nobody gets what they were supposed to get and it just really messes up everything just because Michael wants to do it a certain way but that's a funny one um, this is another uh, classic series and that comes on if you're really into action figures, you know, in 80s, you know, pop culture and stuff like that, 90s pop culture, Robot Chicken. Uh, this is, I think, the, the only season I know of that's got a very specific Christmas episode. It starts around this time. Uh, there is kind of like a little Christmas special, but this one is called, um, I'm trying to remember what the name of it was, uh, Robot Chicken's Half-Ass Christmas Special. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, this, this show is really pretty funny, and... Uh, if, if you kind of like, you know, how they poke fun at, you know, the stuff that you kind of remember from your childhood or just any kind of number of, you know, random things, this is a really good, you know, like short little Christmas special that you can watch about any time. It's one I really like to watch. Um, here's one that I just threw in for nostalgia reason, thinking of that robot chicken. And it's the He-Man and She-Ra uh, Christmas special. And surprisingly, this is very... This is more 80s than the regular He-Man in a weird way just because, you know, they don't really do Christmas specials like this anymore with kids' show or it doesn't feel this way. Uh, this one here is a sealed copy. I had seen this on VHS years ago, and then now this one's uh, a little bit harder to find out of print. I've kept it sealed, you know, just for collectible reasons. But, yeah, this is the He-Man she -Ra, you know, Christmas special, and that's a, that's a good nostalgic one. If you've got that one or got access to it, you might want to bust it out. Uh, these last two I'm just going to throw in because um, I'm a big fan of both these shows and I can always find something from these for about any occasion. Uh, the first one I'm going to throw in is X-Files, and this is actually season six. And there's an episode called uh, How the Ghost Stole Christmas. And I haven't seen this one in a long time, and I was just kind of occurred to me when I was looking through this stuff that I was going to watch. Uh, season six is one of those few seasons that I've probably only seen all the way through like once. Um, 
And I just need to go back and watch that. It's got Lily Tomlin in it, and uh, they play the, the, well, Scully and Mulder, they get trapped in a house, and it's haunted, and it's around Christmas Eve or something like that. I can't remember exactly. But I just remember it was kind of interesting to see a Christmas episode. So, um, yeah, X-Files, season six, that's a good one to watch. Um, the last one I'll show is just one of my other favorite shows. It's Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Uh, and season three was one of the few that I actually remember had a very, you know, specific um, Christmas episode that actually, uh, when this was on the WB, there was a lot of promotions for this episode, and I don't know why, but they really played it up big. And um, it was an episode where, Everything that happened in it seemed really kind of cheesy, uh, but at the end, if you watch the show all the way through seven seasons, you would realize in the seventh season that the stuff that happens in this episode is actually really, really important to how the entire series played out, which is surprising, because this isn't exactly a, you know, a great episode or anything, but it's actually pretty important to a great series. Um, but yeah, it's in the, the third season, and I believe the name of it is uh, Amends, yeah, Amends. And it's one of the few that uh, actually has a very strong kind of 80s, 90s uh, Christmas feel to it. You know, it's got like a story and, and there's, uh, you know, a lesson to be learned and everything. And it kind of has a lot of Christmassy style music towards the end and everything. It's, it's just really strange, but it's a good show. And uh, if you're a fan of that show, you might go revisit that episode. As a whole, that's it. And I just want to say that I'm going to do a 300 subs video really soon. So it may be right after this. So, you know, just keep watching my channel and it is coming up pretty soon because I want to do a 300 subs and acknowledge that I had missed my 200 subs. And, you know, I was going to do something for that. So I'm going to do something kind of special for my 300 subs. And that's pretty much it. I appreciate you guys for watching. And I will definitely try to do a DVD update when I get a little bit more stuff. Uh, it's just kind of hard this time of year to do a lot of shopping. So I will definitely try to do one before Christmas. But if not, I'll do a really big one right after Christmas. Because I've got some stuff I'm hoping I'll get. And uh, I can just add that all together. So I appreciate you guys. And thanks for stopping by. And thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.